Hello friends, in this video we are going to discover the top 10 most affordable countries to live in the world 2024. Have you ever dreamt of living in a country where all your living expenses are under $1,000? Well, if you have, then you'll be pleased to know that the countries listed below offer exactly that. This list has been created based on accommodation and living expenses per month, for a single person living on their own. From countries in the Far East to tropical paradises in Central America, these are the 10 cheapest countries to live in worldwide. Kindly make sure to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon before we start this video about the 10 most affordable countries to live in the world 2024. Now let's dig deeper into each of the top 10 most affordable countries to live in the world 2024. Number 10. Cambodia. Cost, $812 per month. Kicking off our list of the cheapest countries to live in worldwide is Cambodia. Cambodia is centrally located in Southeast Asia and is also known as Kampuchea, or the Kingdom of Cambodia. It's approximately 181,035 square kilometers in area and borders Thailand, Laos, Vietnam and the Gulf of Thailand. Cambodia's capital city is Phnom Penh and its total population is around 16 million people. Overall, the cost of living in Cambodia is very cheap, costing under $1,000 a month. Renting a small one-bedroom studio apartment in one of the cheapest cities in Cambodia, Sihanoukville, will cost you around $246 a month, or $32 a night in an Airbnb. The currency in Cambodia is called Riel, KHR, and roughly 97.7% of the population practice Buddhism. Number 9. Thailand. Cost, $679 per month. Thailand is the ninth cheapest country to live in worldwide. Officially called the Kingdom of Thailand, and previously called Siam, Thailand is a country located in the center of Southeast Asia and has 76 provinces. At over 513,120 square kilometers, Thailand is the 50th largest country in the world, with a total population of just over 69 million people. A one-bedroom studio apartment in one of the cheapest cities, Udon Thani, will cost you around $199 a month, or $40 a night in an Airbnb. Thailand's capital city is Bangkok, the currency is Thai baht and 94.5% of the population are Buddhists. Number 8. Malaysia. Cost, $588 per month. Next on the list is Malaysia costing as little as $588 a month for basic accommodation and living expenses. Like the previous two countries, Malaysia is also located in Southeast Asia and borders Singapore, Thailand, Vietnam and Indonesia. Malaysia consists of 13 states and three federal territories, which are separated by the South China Sea into two regions. The regions, the peninsula of Malaysia and East Malaysia, are of similar size and the total area of Malaysia is 330,803 square kilometers. Malaysia's has a total population of 31.6 million people and Kuala Lumpur is its capital city. When booking accommodation, you'll be looking at spending around $209 a month for a one-bedroom apartment in one of the cheapest cities, like Kota Kinabalu, or $35 a night for an Airbnb. In Malaysia, you can enjoy a beer for around $1.57, a coffee for $0.60 cents and a basic meal out dinner out for $1.69. Number 7. Mexico. Cost, $587 per month. Mexico can be found in the southernmost portion of the United States. As well as boarding the U.S., it also borders the Pacific Ocean, Guatemala, Belize, the Caribbean Sea and the Gulf of Mexico. Mexico is the fifth largest nation in the Americas, covering an approximate 2 million square kilometers, and the 13th largest state. It has a current population of just over 129 million people and Mexico City is its capital. 83% of the population is Catholic and Mexico's currency is pesos, MXN. A month in a one-bedroom studio apartment, in one of the cheapest cities in Mexico, Querétaro, will cost you around $256 a month, or $24 a night in an Airbnb. When it comes to the essentials, like beer, coffee, and eating out, you're looking at spending around $1.54 for a beer, $1 for a coffee and $3.10 for a meal out. Number 6. Peru. Cost, $543 per month. The sixth cheapest country in the world to live in is Peru. 
For an average living cost of around $543 a month, this Spanish-speaking country is well worth checking out if you're looking for a cheap place to live. Peru is a country located in the western part of South America. It borders Ecuador, Colombia, Brazil, Bolivia, Chile, and the Pacific Ocean. Its current population is 32.17 million people, spread over a total area of 1,285,216 square kilometers. 73.7% of its population is Roman Catholic and the Peruvian currency is Sol, Pen. When booking your accommodation, you'll be looking at spending around $198 a month for a one-bedroom apartment in the city center, or $24 a night for an Airbnb. These prices are based on the city of Arequipa. Whilst you're there, you're going to need to eat and drink. A normal size beer will cost you around $1.47, a coffee is approximately $0.98 cents and a meal out can be as little as $2.94. Number 5. Argentina. Cost, $542 per month. Coming in at number 5 on our list is Argentina. A mere $542 a month can get a single-person accommodation and living expenses for a whole month in one of the cheapest cities in Argentina, Salta. Argentina is another Spanish-speaking country, located in the southern half of South America. It borders Chile, Bolivia, Paraguay, Brazil, Uruguay, the South Atlantic Ocean and the Drake Passage. Argentina is the eighth-largest country in the world and the second-largest after Brazil, with a total population of just over 44 million people and covering a mainland area of 2,780, 400 square kilometers. If you're considering living in Argentina, as it's one of the cheapest countries in the world, then you'll be pleased to know that you can get a one-bedroom apartment for $100 a month, or roughly $27 a night depending on the time of year. This will be located in the city of Salta. A meal out will cost you approximately $1.70, beer is around 80 cents and coffee is roughly 55 cents. Number 4. Vietnam. Cost, $500 per month. Vietnam will cost you all of $500 to live in for an entire month, as it's one of the cheapest countries in the world by far. It's the easternmost country on the Southeast Asian Indochinese Peninsula and shares borders with China, Laos, and Cambodia. Vietnam has approximately 95.5 million people living across a total of 331,212 square kilometers. Its capital city is Hanoi, but Ho Chi Minh City is its most populated city. When choosing a place to stay in Vietnam, the cheapest city, Nha Trang, will cost you around $259 a month for a one-bedroom apartment in the city, or $24 a night in an Airbnb. All your other essentials like food, beer and coffee will cost approximately $0.58 cents for a coffee, $0.86 cents for a beer and $1.73 for a meal out. There are lots of cheap things to do to keep you busy in Vietnam, and once you've been living there for a while, like most places on the list, you'll probably be able to find even cheaper accommodation and activities. Number 3. Nepal. Cost, $450 per month. Breaking the $500 a month mark is Nepal, which is the third cheapest country to live in worldwide. Nepal is located in Southeast Asia, mainly in the Himalayas, but also includes parts in the Indo-Gangetic Plain. It has a total current population of 29.3 million people living across a total landmass of 147,181 square kilometers. Bordering China and India, Nepal is the 48th largest country by population and the 93rd largest country by area in the world. $164 will get you a one-bedroom studio apartment in one of Nepal's cheapest cities, Pakhara, or you'll spend approximately $23 a night in an Airbnb. One beer will cost you around $1, coffee is approximately 73 cents and a meal out can cost around $2.08. Number 2. Bolivia. Cost, $431 per month. Bolivia is a landlocked country, located in the western part of South America. Its current population is approximately 11.05 million people living across a total area of 1,098,581 square kilometers. The capital city of Bolivia is Sucre, and Bolivia is made up of a multi-ethnic society, including American Indians, Africans, Asians, Europeans and Mestizos. Bolivia is the fifth largest country in South America and the 27th largest country in the world. 
For those of you that speak Spanish, you'll be pleased to know that Spanish is the official and predominant language of Bolivia, however, there are also 36 other indigenous languages spoken in the country. A one-bedroom studio apartment in La Paz, one of the cheapest cities in Bolivia, will cost you around $145 a month, or $23 a night in an Airbnb. Both beer and coffee are around about $1 each, and you certainly won't break the bank when eating out, as a typical meal will cost you all of $2. Number 1. Indonesia. Cost, $340 per month. The cheapest place to live in, worldwide, is Indonesia. Indonesia, or the Republic of Indonesia, is located between the Indian and Pacific Oceans, in Southeast Asia. Home to approximately 17,000 islands, it's the world's largest island country and has a total population of 264 million people, which also makes it the world's fourth most populated country. There are certain places in Indonesia, like Bali and Jakarta that are more comparable on price to other major western cities around the world. However, places like Singjiji and Lombok can provide you with accommodation and living expenses for as little as $340 a month. You're looking at paying approximately $142 a month for a one-bedroom studio apartment, or $12 a night for a hotel. The luxury essentials like beer, coffee and coconuts cost as little as 89 cents for a beer, 10 cents for a coconut, 71 cents for coffee and $1.77 for a meal out. Indonesia is the best and cheapest country to live in worldwide. So, which is your favorite countries among the top 10 most affordable countries to live in the world 2024? Well, that's all we have for you today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the content of this video, click the subscribe button so you can receive more content like this. Post your favorite countries among the top 10 most affordable countries to live in the world 2024 in the comments below. I'd love to read them and I'm sure others would too.